Let's start by creating a new template. Here, you'll lay out the design for your product. I'll give it a name, and since I already have a print file that I would like to use to create this template, I'll go to Upload File. Here, I will select the image that will be the base of my design. It's important to make sure that this image has the correct size and quality for printing. In this case, I'll use the canvas for six names. Notice how the canvas has no names on it. This is because the names are the personalizable part that we will add with Customly. Here we are in Customly's Design Studio. It's where we will add all the personalizable text. Drag and drop to resize and position the text where it needs to go. You can also rotate it and add perspective to make it match the design perfectly. Choose the font and the size you want the text to have. In this case, we'll give the font size a range with the maximum and minimum font size values. This way, if customers type short or long names, it will resize to fit the sign perfectly. Let's change the text color to make it match the print file better. Now, let's copy the text layer to create the remaining texts. Copy using your keyboard with Command or Control C, then paste with Command or Control V. We will rename the layers to keep things organized. Give it a name with clear instructions as this is what we'll use to create the titles of the options on your store. Select the format you'd like to use for your print file. When it's ready, you can move on to configure the preview. 